Hi, this is the Anime here. Today, I am reviewing a game called Race the Sun. Race the Sun is a never-ending platformer type game. You are a solar craft in a race through time. You have to make sure you get power-ups to raise the sun. If the sun goes down, your energy will go down, and you will die. You have stuff that you can add to your solar craft to help you out. You also have these pyramid things that are, like, scores. Yeah, I don't get it. The, the creators are probably on crack. The game has an awesome community of add-on maps. Pages of awesome maps that the community has made and is all easy to install thanks to the Steam Workshop. The game also has a really simple and easy to use level editor. When you're new to the game, it will give you a manual on the level editor, but if you're anything like me, you just say the manual. I just said flip the manual. Steve, all you do is troll me. Now it's, now it's permanently in a video. Stop beeping me. Gosh. But as I was saying, Steve, okay, okay, the level editor. If we get through this without any interruptions, you can have rants, walls, tries, and a whole bunch more. When you're ready, go ahead and test it. I would give this game a 9 out of 10. I think we could have more customization, or maybe more solar crafts that we could unlock. With the customization aspect, I think we can have new wings, bodies, and even more engines. All in all, this is a great game. Awesome gameplay and one of the best platformer games I have ever played. I would totally check it out. Now, please excuse me while I try to beat this game. Gosh, Steve. And while I beat up Steve. So before I do that, don't forget to rate, comment, subscribe. I'd love a new addition to my pilot. Also, don't forget to check out my website and donate. Aerobatic pilots cost less, but has less perks. Air Oshkosh pilots pay more and get more perks. Perks! I guess we banging choppers with them text. text. No time is wasted, no, not a set. Y'all got that game plan, better get it set.